Welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Jada and I go by the Ben Simmer. If you are a returning watcher, hi Pookie. So in today's video, we are hanging out with the Westbrooks again. And yeah, we got some stuff to talk about because on the last episode where we left off, Camille finally was able to get clarification on who her husband has been creeping around with, okay? And the creepy crawler herself, Tatum. So <laughs> she was able to figure out that it is Tatum that he has been, you know, cheating on her with. And that has been quite the shock, obviously, right, for Camille. And she's really been trying to navigate how she's going to go forward, knowing what she knows now. Because at the end of the day for Camille, okay, she wants to remain the certain, like, caliber, the certain... I don't know, she just wants to come off a certain type of way. Anything coming out about her husband cheating on her with a child, pretty much. It's not, you know, they're all adults. Everyone's adults. But someone she basically raised as her child and kind of took under her wing. And, you know, they have history. Huh. And for her to feel this type of betrayal is just something completely new for Camille. <laughs> she doesn't know what to do, okay? But there are some things that she's done... Mm -hmm since finding out what she knows and we'll get into those things but mm. for the most part she's just keeping her poker face on <sighs> while she figures out her next move because she just wants to be strategic about it you know what i mean but that's kind of our recap for miss camille and what we found out at the end of the last episode so going forward this episode here we are going to spend some time with camille today we are here with her at work right now and she's going to just have a work day after work, we're going to go to this little cafe with Manami, and they're just gonna kind of just have a heart to heart together. They're gonna hang out and, you know, just get a little snack and some drink and just kind of unwind for the night. Then we also have a trial with Camille again against no other than Byron. And we have an update from Byron as well, too, right? Oh. He found out as well. That Tatum is the one that Darius is sleeping around with or just that Darius is sleeping around in general. But with who, it's like he is, yeah, he's sitting on some gold as, or so he thinks. Ooh, but we'll get into that also a little bit later this episode, okay? <laughs> but on the flip side with our kiddos, um, we're going to be hanging out with Addie and Maddie this episode. They're going to do some things with their friends. And Adeline has a little nice date this episode with Casey. That's pretty much our recap. So let's get into this episode, honey. <laughs> All right. So right now, um, this mod, the lawyer mod by Kira Sims, Kira for Sims, I think. The mod is still working for kind of like the active workday portion of it. But some of the stuff is not working. Like, I don't have the law career interactions on the computer right now. <laughs> so we're just going to act like they are. I'm going to have her attend a conference call. Oh, oh, oh. Woo. oh nice. Okay, Madison made us some money, honey. Huh? Oh, <laughs> yes. And speaking of money, let's get into this really quick, you guys. I want to kind of update you on this also. So since we did find out what we found out about the money portion of it, that Darius is just tricking off on um, Miss Creepy Crawler from the business funds, Camille took it upon herself to go to Essen Bank and open a couple of accounts. Okay, so let's take a look. So she opened up an account strictly for business funds that is only under her name. So not all of the funds were put into this account, obviously, but she put a pretty big deposit when she opened the account. There's $100,000 in there. But going forward, any money that Camille or Darius gets from the clients, they're going to go into this business account. 
And she just wants to do this and see if Darius notices for one, and which he probably will, right? He's going to notice, but she wants to see if he's going to say anything about it. Because if he does, then he's kind of going to give himself up. She's going to be like, well, why are you so interested in our business funds? It should stay in the business funds. That's strictly for, you know, to, to pour back into the company. She really is playing the long game because my bitch is a boss, okay? She's a boss and she's strategic. And she's a goddamn lawyer. Like, she knows what she's doing, okay? But yeah, now I'm gonna have Camille just check some emails. And I'll probably have her chat, honestly, with, with Manami. And tell her, hey, meet me at the Bloom Lounge later today. Or the Bloom Cafe. <laughs> So yeah, as you guys can see, this is like an active... Ah, hello? Moises. Hey Camille, Tanya Leigh has asked me out on a date. Should I say yes? Romance is in the air. Mm. You do your thing, boo. This is taking forever, kind of. Okay, I'm gonna have her check the work emails. And then... Whatever, we're not gonna chat. <laughs> like, yes. whatever. We're probably gonna leave early. And... Go straight to the cafe. All right, so we're done. So I'm gonna have her wrap up here and then I'm going to meet up with Manami at this cafe, y'all. And I'll see y'all in a second, okay, bye. Zombo. All right, y'all, we made it to the Bloom Zombo. Garden and Cafe. No. This is a build by uh, Raya28. But yeah, we're here with Manami and we're just having brunch. So yeah, we got a little spread going on. And yeah, I don't know. Camille is currently talking to her just about her marriage, honey. <laughs> They're just talking about Darius and Tatum and kind of just, you know how we do when we girls. We found out some shit. You just talk and talk and talk and talk and talk, okay? It never ends. <laughs> but rightfully so. She is, feels like Manami is one of the few people that she can trust with these sort of conversations. So yeah, she's just, she's kind of letting it all out right now <laughs> but they're also here enjoying some food so manami has some waffles here and camille has some avocado toast with eggs and then this is also um i think some toast avocado toast she has more avocado toast and then they both have a a green tea i want camille to complain about love life oh my gosh what the heck um, excuse me, what the actual hell? She just stole our drink. How rude. Uh, honestly. Like, go away. What the heck? And then tomorrow we have a fun little half day, maybe. A few hours, we're gonna hang out with the girls. They're gonna go to the gym. There's a new gym in town, so they're gonna go check that out. Let's see what else we could talk about with Manami. Let's see. Let's ask for relationship approval. Oh my gosh, let's see what she says. It's like, what do you think, girl? Uh -huh. mm, I don't know about them, so I would like to meet them before giving my approval. Period. Manami said, I don't know that man. Okay. Let's ask about another sim. Let's ask about Byron Fink. Anna. Let's just talk about him. Harvini. Bushar Kumio. Kibaya. Chibaldorf. Amudini. I like Byron. He's pretty cool. Interesting. <laughs> you know, it's crazy because Camille really does be minding her business. She minds her business and she is just, I don't know. Like, she's really unproblematic. So for people to be fucking with her the way that they do is oh. absolutely crazy. That's okay. We got some for that. You know what I'm saying? We got some for that. All right. 
So yeah, Camille was like mad hungry. Let's see. I think we have a new sentiment. For Camille. Okay, Manami does. Let's see. Adoring, closer for from happy memories. Okay. Oh, oh, yeah, 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 you guys. Yeah, you guys. So we didn't even go over our freaking sentiments like that Camille has. They have drifting love. Furious about cheating and betrayed by cheating. And then Darius has sentiments for Camille. He's saddened by what he did. Or I guess like he's saddened about the rift in their relationship. And then he feels guilty about it. So that wasn't there before. So I don't know, y'all. And then for Tatum, she does have some also now. So she has stole my partner. And festering grudge, furious. And she's hurt, obviously, by the betrayal because what the hell you know and fabi narble ah. <laughs> it's pretty insane oh. they're just having a ball right now let me see if there's anything else that they can do here um but yeah no check out this spot you guys it's absolutely gorgeous i think i'm gonna have them come over here and play chess all right, y'all. Um, it wasn't letting Manami play chess, so <laughs> she's just playing. And I don't know. I don't think we're gonna do anything else here at this garden and cafe. But yeah, we're just gonna wrap this little segment up of Camille's workday. We're gonna touch back with Camille um after we hang out with the girls. And yeah, we're gonna go to that trial. All right, y'all. So we made it to the gym. We made it to the gym. So we are at the Simquinox gym, and it's a new gym in Windenburg. And this build is by Jack's Play Sims. And yeah, she ate. <laughs> it's such a nice gym. It's giving looks, modern looks. It's real cute. Um, but yeah, no, we're here with pretty much the gang. It's Maddie, Addie, Kaysen, Tatum. <laughs> and the Dempseys are around here somewhere. So they're just getting their gains. And yeah, I plan to spend a decent amount of time here. I think I'm going to have everyone like push their limits. Yeah, already. Maddie's already feeling it. She's like, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, so Liam just finished working out right here. Honestly, like, why are you looking at me like that? Like, literally, please. Like, <laughs> our cuties are here and they just finished doing some stuff over here. I'm going to have them come box jump. Okay. And then I want. Addie and Kaysen to come over here. So yeah, I'm going to have Adeline and Kass Kaysen. They're going to go box. And where is... Okay, so Tatum, what can we have you do, girl? Um, I'll have her run on the treadmill. Hopefully she busts her ass. Oh my gosh, run with her chest out. Hello? Yeah, you like to do that, don't you, girl? Let's go, Addy. Yeah. Yeah. Period. This gym is absolutely freaking gorgeous. <laughs> like, are you joking me? This is funny. But yeah, no, this gym is located in kind of like that court area. And it's right across the street from the Ralph Lauren store that we went to on our last episode. Adeline and Kaysen have their date tonight. So we're going to hang out at the gym probably until, honestly, the early afternoon. And then everyone's going to depart. Hello. Uh, Don't cheer off her man, girl. Tatum's like, yeah, so have you heard of a sugar daddy? Because I'm very familiar with those. I'm gonna have um, Madison come ride the bike. I'm gonna have Madison do a vlog here soon. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> and you know, I kind of hate that Tatum did what she did because it's just kind of tarnished. I don't know. I feel like it's tarnished the, the Dempsey's a little bit. Not all of them because the boys don't even know. You know what I mean? But it's just like Maddie. I feel like Maddie and Liam could have been like.
They could have been something. Do you know what I mean? Sweet. Madison has reached fitness level five. She can now make protein shakes at the bar. She can also perform the no sweat run on the treadmill. Nice. Oh my gosh, she just got skinnier. Did y'all see that? She got fitter. Madison's hard work, is, hard work is paying off and she can see it in her new shape. Okay, but I see the waist though. The waist is wasted. Okay, and I think there's some stuff up here that I want them to check out. There's just these little rowing machines and there's a massage. Oh, there's a sauna. So let me see, it's 11 o'clock right now. I'm gonna have a... Uh, I'm gonna have her do one more workout. So I think I'm just gonna have her do a no sweat run so she can flex a little bit. <laughs> okay, let's see, what can Knox do? I guess Knox can come do the same thing. He can come lift weights. Keep that physique that he already got, okay. Oh, slow down, baby, no, I'm just kidding. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> Okay, yoga class is beginning. You know what? Let's just finish it with yoga and then we'll do the sauna. What the heck? Okay. <laughs> so everyone took our spa. <laughs> Look at them. <laughs> oh gosh. Maddie does not like that. She's not very happy about that. Maybe in the next batch, whatever, it's really not that deep. I'm gonna have them all come relax in the sauna together. Oh my god, y'all, we can't see nothing. <laughs> um, let me see. Okay, so I think, yeah, Nox is- Ooh, hey, Nox! She was definitely feeling that. She liked what she saw. But yeah, I'm gonna just let them chill in the sauna and do their thing. Um, I don't know, y'all. I'm talking about Maddie and Liam, but, like, genuinely, I don't know. I just want her to get a boo, but she says she's single and she's loving it. So I'm gonna just let her do her thing. But- that might change next episode, okay? And I'll go a little bit in detail about what we're doing for our next episode here in a little bit, but yeah. Alright, so it's getting hot in here. Oh, it's getting a little too packed up in here. Too many people. Too many goddamn people. Alright, so everyone just pretty much is chilling now, and we are pretty much wrapping up here. <laughs> we're wrapping up at the gym, and we're gonna go uh, back to the estate and get ready for our date. I don't think I'm going to show that part. Um, I'll just meet y'all at the restaurant, and yeah, I'll see you guys there. Alright, so we made it to the restaurant. We are at La Ventura, um, a new restaurant here in Windenburg. This build is by Ashy Place, and it's absolutely gorgeous. Like, I'm literally obsessed with it. <laughs> but yeah, no, we made it here with Kaysen, and yeah, we're about to order here in a second, but I'm just letting them mingle a little bit, you know what I mean? Adeline looks dashing. So does Kaysen. They look really nice. And yeah, Kaysen has some plans for Adeline at this dinner today. So yeah, we're going to eat first and then we'll kind of get into some other things afterward. Okay. Okay, so we are on a date event. So we got to socialize with our date. Uh, we did request a table, so I'm just going to cheat it. <laughs> And then we need to order our food. So let's go ahead and order for the table. I'm gonna have them probably order a bottle too, to be honest. So I think we're gonna order a bottle so we won't get a drink. Um, but let's see, we have a little fancy menu here. Um, I think for Adeline, she's gonna get the Raka lamb. No, I'll get her the tuna. No, I'll get her the steak. <laughs> and then for Kaysen, I'll have him get the rack of lamb. And then, yeah, we're going to order a bottle. So let's see. Order a bottle. We're going to get some wine. We'll get some. Ooh, we'll get the expensive wine. The Nobel di Montepulciano. <laughs> Perhaps a salad, madam. Perhaps not. Like, <laughs> Give me all the food. Thank you. Okay, so it says we need to have deep conversations with our date. Friendly, deep thoughts. Let's ask about love life. And then... We'll have a deep conversation. Oh, okay. Adeline likes, Adeline likes stories. Yes. And then we're going to have another deep conversation. 
Ooh, so Kason's feeling very flirty. Like, he's feeling extra, extra, extra flirty. Oh, and also, guys, don't mind the sexual stamina um, thing. I was posing them for pictures and stuff before this, and it just didn't go away. So just don't worry about it, okay? Guna. Bilbar. Oh, Pimpini. Uh. Adeline shows signs of the sage personality. Sage sims seek wisdom and focus on finding the truth in every situation, honey. However, their knowledge-seeking nature might cause them to think too much and not act enough. Ooh. And Kaysen has learned the following traits about Adeline. She is a perfectionist. Very much so. <laughs> Let's see how Adeline's feeling. So she's feeling very flirty, too. She's just having a hot dinner date. The lot has a romantic atmosphere, so that's helping kind of like... You know, get them together. So let's do another deep conversation so we can get the buff. Let's give relationship advice, I guess. Oh my gosh, the food got here so fast. And I ordered a bottle. Did it not come? Or what? Oh my gosh. Oh, it's not working. Damn. Okay, well then, we're going to order some drinks. <laughs> We'll order a drink here. <laughs> but Adeline, yeah, y'all go ahead and start eating, okay? So let's see. Well, we'll get the we'll get the wine here. We'll get the puccini. Oh no, it's right here. We can get the glass of wine here. Okay, perfect. The Nobile di Monte Pusiano. <laughs> this food looks amazing, actually. It looks good as fuck. Just like a glass of wine, please. Thank you. Period. Ooh, that bill gonna be hefty, Kaysen. You better be ready to pay that tab, baby. Okay, so, hold on. The deep conversation thing did not complete, even though we did it like three times, so... I'm gonna cheat it. Thank you. <laughs> and let's see, we have to socialize about the meal. Uh, savor the flavors. And then I'll have him, let me go back there. Relish cuisine's delicious nature. Okay. Oh. oh my gosh, what the heck? So we're gonna try this one more time. We're just gonna order the drinks from the game. So let's get the gentle lily and cool day. I'll have Kaysen get cool day and Addy get the gentle lily. Cause I want them to have a drink too, you know? Huh? What the heck is she, where is she going? Uh, no, what the hell? Can never have anything just work right in this damn game. <laughs> anyway, so <laughs> I'm gonna have them sit and enjoy their drink. Oh. Period. Okay, we can have our little drinks now. Girl, uh, hello? No one asked you to be here. I will literally destroy object. Don't play with me, girl. But yeah, no, I don't like in case in. They've been spending a lot of time, like I've said before, but they're really getting very, very, very close. And yeah, I don't like just really, really, really likes him. So the date is about to be almost over. So... Let's end the mill and pay the bill. And then I'm going to have him ask her what I want him to ask her. So I'm going to have him offer her a rose. And then you guys, he's going to ask her to be his girlfriend. And then we'll see. So cute. Um, I don't... <laughs> That did not go the way that I wanted it to go. <laughs> I had a uh, override. It's like the rose override. Um, and it was supposed to be like really wrapped, really pretty. But that just did not come out the way <laughs> that I thought. It's okay though. It's all right. It's all right. We're going to ask to be girlfriend. And then we'll probably ask to stay the night. So they're going to go back to his house for the night. Oh my gosh, y'all. Yay! Oh my gosh! Period! So they're now official. So, Kaysen does have the soulmate aspiration. 
like he is just wanting to find a soulmate and that's what he feels like his life purpose is and he feels like he might have found that in Adeline so I don't know y'all all right, that was a very successful date night. So now Adeline has her little boo and we about to go to the Kaysen or the Fink residence, baby. And they gonna do what it do. <laughs> I'll see you on a second, okay? All right, y'all. So we made it back. We're at Kaysen's house. And yeah, they got to get into some things, okay? So pretty much, um, we're not gonna get into this as you know detailed, but I am using this little segment of the video to let you guys know that I will be switching over to Wicked Whims and having exclusive Patreon episodes of both series. So that's gonna be something that I'm starting really soon. It won't be on today's episode, <laughs> but um, yeah, it's gonna be soon. So just, if you're interested, check out my Patreon and yeah, we gonna get into it. Cause what the hell is it getting, oh my God. <laughs> Hold on, let me pause this, honey. I talked about it on my last episode of Mint Condition. And I just wanted to talk about it here also. Um, but yeah, if you guys, are interested my patreon is linked down below and i'm gonna have a new tier for that but i will keep y'all updated okay but yeah no they're just doing what they do i'm gonna let them just kind of chill and they're gonna take it easy go to sleep soon and then we're going to catch back up with camille tomorrow and also eugene and deidre so yeah that's our next segment of this episode and yeah i will see y'all tomorrow all right, y'all, so we made it back to the Westbrook's estate. We're here with Deidre and Eugene. So Eugene is still going to dialysis, of course. So he really has been navigating his kidney disease really well. Um, he's starting to just get used to the dialysis. It's rough. It's still very rough for him to deal with and to go to multiple times a week, but it's kind of just become part of his routine and he's just trying to see the positive light and everything. They are looking for a transplant or they're like interested in seeing what they have, you know, what their options are when it comes to that. So at today's dialysis appointment with Eugene, after they're gonna speak with the doctor and kind of figure out what they need to do going forward, what steps they might need to take to, you know, see about getting a donor. So that's kind of like where we're at with Eugene. He hasn't told anyone still because he just doesn't want to yet. I don't know. He he has a lot of pride when it comes to that sort of stuff. So yeah, he hasn't told anyone but Deidre and she's just trying to uplift him while he uplifts himself. You know what I mean? We are going to go to dialysis. It is going to be a little bit later today in the afternoon. We're going to hang out with who's here at the house until later this afternoon. When Camille gets out of work, because after she gets out of work, she's going straight to her trial. But yeah, so they're just here. They're talking. Madison is up here in her room. I kind of want her to. Okay, well, calm down a little bit, girl. She's playful. Like, let's tone that down a little bit. And then I want her to just like freshen up. Milzy? And I'm gonna have her put a, a face mask on. <sighs> it's been raining, like, I feel like it's always raining in my game. Let's talk a little bit about next episode. So this upcoming episode for Madison, it's gonna be all about Madison. Intro, outro, full episode gameplay. I'm focusing on my girl, okay? She is going to take a solo trip out to Delso Valley and it's gonna be her and elliot they're gonna go out there together but they have like this huge influencer party that they're gonna go to and she's gonna be networking like super majors but yeah she's just really gonna network mingle and party <laughs> but we're really gonna get into madison's like just everyday thing and then also get into more of like her needs and her wants as an individual but let's see what can she do next so she studied some trends i think let's put some music on Let's turn on some alternative and then I'm just going to have her come over here and I'll have her play Grand Theft Auto. She might want to get into her streamer bag too, but we don't know quite yet. Speaking of streaming, I'm going to start streaming on Twitch. So if you guys want to follow me there, it's twitch.tv slash Mint Simmer or The Mint Simmer. I don't know. I'll have it on the screen. <laughs> But I will be doing prep for the Westbrooks and Mint Condition there. Um, and also just like random create a sim or random builds that I do. 
um yeah when i have the time to stream and, and talk with you guys i'll be on there doing that so yeah hit me up on twitch uh, uh, uh -huh. the grandparents are still over here they're just chatting it up they're being lovebirds per usual madison is very angry because she's just high maintenance she says she's having the worst day ever but she's fine <laughs> like she'll be okay she's really getting her gamer on with a face mask this is literally how i look like playing my game <laughs> literally me especially when it's raining oh my gosh like a rainy day with sims is just like i don't know y'all that's really some therapeutic shit right there why is she stomping around like that <laughs> like it's really not that serious girl she is so annoying <laughs> <laughs> but no, she she's funny. She's just such a bougie little biatch. I love her. Ooh, that looks nice. This is from the Oni recipe pack. She is so annoying the way she stomps around like that. Oh, now she's just gonna be over here and give the negative energy to her grandparents. <laughs> Like, this is actually so ridiculous. Like, girl, fix your face. Her coming over here to just fucking be mean and rude is so funny. I was like, girl, keep that shit over there. Alright, y'all, so we made it to the trial. And yes, we are going against Fink again. <laughs> because he keeps trying to he'll find out that camille is defending somebody and he's like oh i want that other client i want that opposing client he's literally such a player hater and a dick writer i don't know <laughs> but anyway we're here at the courthouse and yeah camille's just doing her thing her usual hey the judge is here he don't give a fuck still and yeah he's you know we'll see how the how the debate goes oh anyway he, he's trying to pull a her on her because he saw her want he saw her yawning the last time you know what i'm saying oh darius is back home and he has earned a thousand dollars hmm and guess where that's going that's going in the other account. Thank you. And we do have some people here with us here watching the trial. We have the family. So Eugene and Deidre, they're here watching it, but they're gonna go to the doctor right after this. Let me cheat her bladder and her energy a little bit. Same for Eugene. Aw, poor Pookie, he's tired. But yeah, and then Manami and Andy are here also. They're kind of just like, you know, they're shadowing her. Making sure she's good, but you already know she's good. She got it. No. Your honor, he's capping. <laughs> like, your honor, his point doesn't even make any sense, okay? And you know Byron is sitting on that information now, and he's also trying to kind of play the low game. He's not lo the long game. He kind of is thinking about how he wants to navigate the information that he knows. You know what I mean? Yeah, let's go, Camille. Period. She won her case again. Thank you. <laughs> like literally, don't even like. Come on now. Don't don't be silly. Yeah, I know you embarrassed Byron like usual. What a joke he is, you know what I mean? Oh, Period. So she's feeling confident. So I'm just going to have her talk with uh, Deidre real quick. She's just going to... No, not romance. What the hell? She's just going to give them a hug. Same with her dad. And she's just going to send them off. And then I'm going to have them go to dialysis treatment. Okay, cute, cute, cute. All right, so let's see. Let's go here to our phone for Eugene. 
healthcare services. All right, we're going to go to our dialysis appointment with Deidre. So I'm gonna send them off. Deidre, go, girl. Oh my God, go, girl. Okay, so they're going straight to dialysis and then I'm going to go home with Camille since she finished her trial. And we're gonna wrap this episode up, okay? All right, you guys, so we're gonna wrap this episode up here. Camille is currently getting dressed. She has a dinner that she's gonna be going to. And yeah, we're gonna get into that a little bit more in the outro, y'all. But yeah, she's getting ready to go to that. Eugene and Deidre are at dialysis. Um, yeah, but we made it to the end of the episode. Pretty eventful episode, a lot happened here. But if you guys enjoyed, don't forget to give me a like, comment, and subscribe. Um, I love interacting with y'all, so yeah, I would really appreciate it. But yes, next episode, like I said, we are going to be spending the entire episode with Madison and Delso Valley, so that'll be super fun and kind of a different pace and tone for the series. But yes, we are going to get into our cinematic intro now. But if you guys want to stay connected with me, my socials are linked down below, and I have a link tree there as well for easy access. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I love you, Pookie, and I'll see you on my next video. Bye!